Hello and welcome again to Christine's Creativity Cabinet. Um, I've got another haul video for you. Yeah, I said I wasn't going to go to Dollar Tree for the rest of the month, but I needed some sugar and that was the best place. That's the cheapest place to get sugar. And so, of course, when I was in there, I got some other things. And I also got some stuff from Target Bullseye's Playground. Um, but, I mean, whatever. <laughs> uh, progress, not perfection. Um, and I know that you guys would enjoy seeing the haul, so I will show you what I got. It's not a really huge haul, which is good, um, but I did get some really cool things, so let me show you. Let's start with uh, Target. Um, I just happened to go in there um, because um, I ordered some crushed tomatoes and for delivery, and they didn't deliver my crushed tomatoes. They delivered diced tomatoes and so I went I went into Target to get crushed tomatoes and what do you know their bullseye's playground was 50% off so I, I got a few cool things there um, I got this which I think is really cool it's a thing that it's got um, clips on it but you could probably do it you could do it this way you could do it the other way and it's got that really nice wood grain on it so this definitely has DIY possibilities um, this says it was three dollars, but it was actually a dollar fifty because um, fifty percent off. And I got a few other cool things. This is supposed to be these are supposed to be wine scorecards. Of course, I'm not a wine drinker, but I think that these really are really cool with the num the numbers on them. They have that kind of vintage look to them, and then they come with a, a bunch of uh, twine to attach them to things. So I, I just I like these number tags here. And I think those have DIY possibilities too. So another dollar fifty item. Um, and then this I thought was really cute. It's a it's a house shaped chalkboard. So that has DIY possibilities. Um, and then speaking of house shaped chalkboards, they also had a really cool banner that looks like this. But if you turn this way, they could be like houses too. Um, I love the Target banners. I'm not a big banner person, but they, they contain all these cool things that you can separate out and use in different DIYs. And then um, they had some more of these words. Um, and again, uh, only $1.50 this time, so I decided like, I'd get some more. All they had left was the Hello and Farmhouse ones, but I think that those are really cool, so I decided to get some more. So that's what I got at Target. And now let's move on to... Dollar Tree. Okay. Um, let's see. Got this bag. All right. Let's see. They had some, oh, they had these beautiful wooden leaves. I think I could do something really cool with that. Um, and then I got also an acorn. So those, those just have really DIY possibilities for like painting and whatever. Um, and Oh, I should know by now, this time of year, Audrey comes out and she likes to sneak in behind me when I'm at Dollar Tree and, and put things in my cart. So look, look at what she put in my cart. Yeah, really, really, really only Audrey would like something like this, but I guess she had to have it. So whatever, I guess. I don't know. I don't know anything. I just work here. Okay. Um. Let's see. They had a bunch of calendars. I was really hoping to find the farmhouse calendar that everybody's been hauling, but they didn't have it. But that, I got two other really cool calendars here. Um, this one says, um, every moment matters. And it, it just, see, look at that. And then look at the beautiful pages in there. Isn't that neat? And it has some nice little inspirational quotes and things. And then there's this one, shine bright at all you do. And th this one has, um, I recently saw Crafts with Caitlin. Um, no, it wasn't Crafts with Caitlin. It was Craft, Eat, Repeat. Yes, Anika made a beautiful thing out of out of this, out of this particular page. And so I'm, I'm thinking that I could probably make something really cool with, with some of these. It's a really cool looking. See, th this is the sort of thing where if you're not into hand lettering, but you like the look, you could, you know... A real easy DIY is to just, just take one of these pages and put it in a frame, and then you've got something nice to go on the wall. Or you could get one of those square Dollar Tree signs and just um, Mod Podge it to the sign, and then you've got something. It's beautiful. Um, so I was happy to get those. Um, 
they had these um i just thought this was so cute with look at those little pumpkins there i have all the different little kinds of pumpkins on there um so i got that for my halloween stuff um i really like these little orange flowers again that those would be be nice in in a fall diy somewhere got some pumpkins i like the this little oblong guy and then I just got several different kinds of pumpkins here. That will be good for DIYs. Then they had ones that had stuff on them. Look at this, isn't that, that cool? It's got a beautiful sunflower on there. And then there's the little gourd that sticks out. I think that's really cute. So that's definitely something. Oh, Audrey. She had to get these pens. I don't need any new pens, but she had to get these pens. Look at this. It's got a little monster on it. I'm sure she's gonna try to do some sort of hideous experiment with these things. Huh? You never can tell with her, but look at that. Look at that. Yep, that's Audrey. Okay, so let's take a look at another bag here. Uh, I always like to get the snack mix for the office. I just like it. Uh, we've got some more pumpkins in here. A pretty white pumpkin. And another one that has stuff on it. Isn't that neat? That's really cute. Um, and this one, nice shiny kind of goldish, copperish one. I think it's pretty cool. And, and then they had these these um, fall. I hesitate to say Indian corn because that's like like it's not good to Native Americans to say that. But they're, that's what I was raised calling these things. It's this pretty corn. But look at that, it's made out of beads. That'll be really nice for some fall stuff here. And then I got a couple more sets here. Let's see what we got here. Oh, I watched Crafts by Caitlin. She made some beautiful sunflowers out of these sun picture frames. And so I decided I'd, I'd like to give that a try as well. I got a couple of those. Um, got these cute little pom-poms. This is gonna be for a special gift that probably won't be in the video. Um, but it's, it's just gonna it's gonna be a special gift and so I got that for that purpose oh and then Audrey snuck in something else again this says eeks I have a feeling she's gonna gonna probably transform this into something really very evil um, so we'll, we'll see about that um, and then oh I got these cute stickers this was this was an impulse purse they had these by the register aren't those cute they're shaker stickers they have a little glitter inside of them I'm a big sucker for stickers. Um, oh, I needed a new hole punch because I tried um, punching holes in a craft stick and it broke my hole punch. So all of you out there, don't make my mistake. Don't try that. So I had to get a new hole punch to replace that. Um, and oh, they had metallic markers that I can always use white markers that are nice and, and opaque. So I, I, I just wanted to pick one of those up since I saw but they had white ones. And then we've got one more bag over here. Okay. They had these great big signs. They're Halloween signs. They say beware. But what I like about them is I like the shape of them. I mean, look at this Go on the back. See, it's, it's like you could make that look like shiplap because of the edges here, make it look like it's made out of, out of, out of boards. So I thought that was cool. So I, I had to get a couple of these. I'm probably going to DIY them. Um, and let's see what else we got here. Um, okay. I've seen other people, I got these wall stickers. I've seen other people use them to make a really cute laundry room sign. I think that that's, so I had to get that. Um, and this says love grows here that's so pretty i love using these these wall stickers in various diy projects and oh audrey strikes again she believed that she absolutely has to have this for her lab so i guess i guess i'll give her that yeah, you know this is appropriate for a lab um let's see what else we got in here oh they had this cute bag that had this um Day of the Dead Skull on it. And it comes with some little markers. These markers are probably not very good, but I, I can use my own markers to color this. 
I just thought that would be really fun to color and make into a, a maybe add to some sort of fabric project. Um, and then they had this gingham ribbon. They didn't have black and white, which is my favorite, but um, they had this red and black, which is very nice. And they had blue and white, red and white, and orange and white. This, will, this I think, will be good for fall. So those are going to go in my ribbon stash. So um, that's it for my haul that I got from Dollar Tree and Target's Bullseye's Playground. Stay tuned for some more fun DIYs for fall, and I'll see you in the next video.